Hey, what is going on guys? It's your man Chance here, Chance the AOBG, and welcome to a brand new LP here on the channel. Brand new spooktacular LP if I do add in. Uh, every October we do love to do a nice and powerful spooktacular themed scary spooky game for the uh, for Halloween. Um, usually we do some type of Resident Evil game, but getting away from all the monotony of, you know, playing Resident Evil every fucking year. We will be playing something a little different. So I figure, why not do Majora's Mask? And do it on 3DS, where it's all updated and whatnot. Uh, I've never actually beat Majora's Mask, so... Why not? And plus, you know, I, I figured since it's a Zelda game, it's gonna be kind- It's gonna be a tad long, uh, so it'll run into November, which isn't bad. Uh, a lot of you out there, I'm pretty sure you watch other YouTube channels, so you guys are fully aware of uh, PBG's uh, November, um, November um, Zelda month. There we go. Um, but yeah, so I mean, at least it'll be fitting somehow anyway. <laughs> but um, yeah, with all, with all those formalities out of the way, uh, actually one more. Uh, we haven't up uploaded in a while, so this is probably one of the first uploads. I've been working on a lot of stuff on the side, uh, besides work and a lot of other stuff. I want to get a, uh, there's a project that I wanted to bring back on this channel, but it's, uh, it's, uh, I'm, I'm getting it in bulk so we don't, you know, run out of it again and, you know, we run into that same situation. Uh, so we're going to have Shovel Knight, that's going to finish out. Uh, we're gonna have uh, New Super Mario Bros. U, which is which has gone way too long, and that's gonna finish out. <laughs> and we're gonna do. Uh, um, I have another one that's, that's gonna come back. Uh, when I started doing Pokemon LPs again, um, I don't know why I haven't I haven't finished uh, like Platinum, which I, I hear is a long game, but I think we can finish it. Uh, I've actually been enjoying that game, but hey. Uh, but without uh, further ado, let's get into the game. Uh, I have a guide for the game since I've never beaten the game before. So, uh, if I run into a snag, um, I can run to the guide, uh, for any help, and, uh, you know, all of that good shit. And also, I'll have you guys, so if you guys have any pointers or tips or tricks or anything of the sort, any, uh, any helpful situations, go ahead and, uh, drop it down in the comment section below, and, uh, I can check that shit out. Um, but, uh, yeah, I've tried to record this several different times. Um, like five or six. So, uh, uh, the last time I got it, I was able to do the entire thing. It was good to go. But, <laughs> we didn't have audio. All the other times, like, the fucking capture went bad and I had to reinstall, uh, drivers. I had to, I had to update the drivers. But, if you guys are looking down there, I have a second file. Swanko played it back in February. That's because of, uh, we streamed this game, got up to the first dungeon, that should all be on Twitch if you wanted to look back at that, but we're going to get to it uh, in this playthrough, so it really doesn't matter, uh, so we're going to make our name a nice and powerful chance, I am, oh, oh shit, we're getting, we're getting fancy with, with the, with the three for an E, but if you guys are familiar with my Pokemon LPs, you guys know when there's a lot of text in the game, I do like to, uh, to give voices, they end up changing all the time and not being that great. But hey, you gotta you gotta work at it, man. Nothing's impossible. And I don't have the circle pad pro. I could probably snag one from work though. Not bad at all. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad one bit. In the land of Hyrule, there echoes a legend, a legend held dearly by the royal family that tells of a boy, a boy who, after battling evil and saving Hyrule, crept away from the land that had made him a legend. Done with the battles that once waged across time, he embarked on a journey as secret and personal journey. A journey in search of a beloved and invaluable friend. A friend with whom he parted ways when he fully fulfilled his heroic destiny into this place. Oh, I fucked it up. I missed that tiny little bit. You guys can pause it and read it. My speed reading skills were not on point for that one. Man, we've only been like three, four minutes into this fucking first episode. I've already talked your fucking ear off. <laughs> I apologize, guys. <laughs> Why do these fairies give each other that, that, that hood rat nod like, Yeah, let's go fuck them up. I'm just out here just doing my, my civil duty. I'm just, I'm just trying to get to a place. Why they gotta try to fuck with me, man? 
I'm, I'm not all about it. I'll spit. Hee <laughs> hee, <laughs> you two fairies did great. I wonder if he has anything good on him. Huh, this guy? Well, that shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> I love the way he shuffles. <laughs> We got Hood Red Skull Kid over here, just taking items off of dead niggas. Ooh, ooh what a pretty ocarina! Hey, Skull Kid, <laughs> let me touch it. I want to see. You can't tell. What would we do if you dropped it and broke it? No way, you can't touch it. Oh, but sis, wh why can't I try it out too? <laughs> Wake up scratching, yawning. What the fuck happened? Nigga, why you got your lips on my shit? Nigga, I don't know where your lips been. Damn, how you just gonna fuck me up, toss me off my own horse, jack my horse. Like, goddamn. That was like running through the hood, just straight up, like. That's like a family who showed up in the wrong neighborhood, they got lost. <laughs> going on a family vacation, like, oh, jeez. Jeez, Barbara, we're, I believe we're, I, I believe we were lost. Ah, right. right, jeez, Jacob, you better ask for directions. Hey, uh, hey there, fellas, uh. We're a little lost. Could you give us a little, a little bit of directions? Hey, they're gonna, they're gonna take our car in for a, for a, for an inspection. I, I, I have been meaning to get a, to get a, to get an oil change. All right, Jacob, but I, I don't think we're getting that car back. I don't think we're getting that car back. And a Geronimo. Mmm, spooky. Got moons and, 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 and masks and, and ocarinas and, and, and sharp teeth. Well, damn. <laughs> What's with that stupid horse of yours? It doesn't listen to a word that's said to it. There's no point in writing a thing like that, so I did you a favor and got rid of it. <laughs> oh, boo-hoo, what a sad face. I just thought I'd have a little fun with you. Well, come now, do you really think you can beat me how I am now, fool? Oh, please, stop shaking your face! Stop shaking your face! I love how Link just had that stoic face while looking at him like, Oh, so you fuck my horse up? Fuck it. <laughs> I'm surrounded! Oh no, this must be a gang initiation! I'm out of here! I gots to go! I gots to go! I heard mom's making spaghetti. I gotta go. I gotta go home. Oh no! I'm hideous! Hideous! Disgusting! Ew! Yucky! <laughs> no, that's a good look for you. You'll stay here looking like that way. Looking that way forever. Ah, oh, come on! Stop, stop bullying me! Stop it! 
I love how he's just floating on air, ass backwards. He said, sis. Whoa, whoa, Skull Kid, wait for me. I'm still here. Tell you can't leave without me. You! If I wasn't dealing with you, I wouldn't have gotten separated from my brother. Well, don't just sit there, Deku Boy. Do something! Why are you looking at me like that? What, is there something stuck on my face? Will you stop staring and just open the door for me? Please, come on and help this little girl is asking you, so hurry up! Hayaku! Hayaku, Hayaku! Oh, Tail, I wonder if that child will be alright on his own. Had to drop some of that otaku nerd favor oh, yeah. otaku nerd flavor on this bullshit Woo! doing my pirouettes my nice and powerful pirouettes hey wait for me don't leave me behind so um that stuff back there I um apologize so so take me with you you want to know about that skull kid who just ran off right well, I just so happen to have an idea of where you might be going. Take me with you and I'll help you out, deal? Please? Good, so then it's settled. Now then, I'll be your partner. Or at least until we catch that Skull Kid. My name's Tattle, so uh, it's nice to meet you or whatever. Now that we got all that straightened out, can we stop messing around and get moving? If I figure something out, press right on the D-pad and I'll tell you. Hopefully, you will managed to get by without my help until then. <laughs> Link breaks the fucking third wall. He's like, ah, oh, I mean the fourth wall. He's like, ah, fucking shit. The things I do for love. And bombs away. And Juranimo. Juranimo. Boop. Looks like we got a, a nice and powerful treasure chest up over here. And away we go. Dude, we barely made that one too. You got a deco nut! Drop some bombs on these knuckles. Do you know how to use items? It's pretty important. Tap on the item button on the lower screen to bring up the select item screen. Select an item using the circle pad and assign it to X, Y, 1, or 2 on the right. You can also tap and slide to assign an item, so do it whichever way you like best. Once you've assigned an item, press the corresponding button or tap the corresponding icon to use it. It's easy. It's easy. Just spray it on your asshole, and no more murky asshole. All right. Boom. By the way, guys, it's like 4:15 in the a.m. My phone has the timer, and it's over there telling me that I might not make it. Ah, oh, but lied. Hey, you! Come on, press L and talk to me. You got it. There you go, see? You can do it if you try. When I fly over to people or objects, use L to look at them so you can interact with them. Use L targeting to talk to people even if they're far away. Or if there's no one to target, you can use L to look straight ahead. But enough about that for now. Come over to this tree and check it out. Alright. But like I was saying, my, my phone's over here using the timer. And my phone's about to die. And I'm hungry. Then I can go for a snack, then a sandwich, and a quarter pounder with cheese. It's strange, but the way you look right now sort of reminds me of this tree. It looks all dark and gloomy, almost like it could start crying any second now. How sad. So what are you trying to say? That I look dead and I might start crying any second now? Fuck you. Fuck you. I love the music in Zelda. Like, the Zelda franchise in general, but... I can win a time, Wind Waker, and uh, Majora's Mask, even though I've never beaten Majora's Mask, but I've heard, uh, uh not a good deal, but like, uh, a, a nice sample of the music. I'm pretty sure most of you guys have heard, uh, e even if you guys haven't played the game, you guys have heard, uh, the Song of Healing, and I adore that song. I am down with it. I am down with it. Okay, that's the Sheikah Stone, so we don't need to use that yet. Alright, so this is a super iconic character. I have to give this guy a dope voice. I don't know what voice I would give him. You have met with a terrible fate, haven't you? I don't know if that voice is doing him justice. Tattles over there hiding. 
I own the happy ma- oh, that's not a good voice. I own the happy mask shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. During my travels, a very important mask was stolen from me by an imp in the woods. So here I am at a loss. And now I've found you. Now don't think me rude, but I have been following you. For I know of a way to return you to your former self. If you can get back the precious item that was stolen from you, I will return to you. I will return you to normal. In exchange, all I ask is that you also get back my precious mask that the imp stole from me. What? Is it not a simple task? Why does someone like you wish it should be? It should by no means be a difficult task. Except the one thing I am very. <clears throat> The one thing is, I'm a very busy fellow, and I must leave this place in three days. How grateful I would be if you could bring it back to me before my time here is up. <laughs> but yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous courage. I'm sure you'll find it right away. Oh, and one more thing. Please be so kind as to direct your gaze over there for a moment. Oh, the Sheikah Stone. I'm down with it. That strange stone over there, do you see it? It's a Sheikah Stone. When the world has weighed you down with worry, crawl inside and let it show you the way. If you ever find yourself lost on your grand adventure, seek the counsel of the wise, Old Stone. It will surely help you on your noble quest. Well then, I'm counting on you. I can see that that uh Mario mask back there is uh, still on his back. It's still upon his back. Dawn of the first day. His voice may change. I, 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 I'm still not quite satisfied with the voice I gave that guy. The happy mask salesman. I may want to give this guy another mask. All right, so here's when the the, the real game comes into play. Cause I don't know 100% of what to do all of the time. Uh, we'll be relying heavily on you guys uh, in the comment section if you guys feel, you know, free to, you know, hit up that comment section to help a brother out. And I will also be relying on the internet and my guide, so. He gives me the creeps. That mass salesman was the... Sorry, just thinking out loud. But three days? Even if we never sleep, that still leaves us with a measly 72 hours. Talk about demanding. Well, don't just stand there. We're going to see the Great Fairy. Look. You want to find the Skull Kid, don't you? The Great Fairy would know what he's up to. She watches over everything. And just between you and me, the Skull Kid is no match for the Great Fairy. I'm pretty sure the Great Fairy lives in a shrine somewhere here in town. Where? Well, somewhere. Don't press me for details. I don't come, I don't come here very often. You could try talking to one of those kids who hang around town. One of them might know where, she, where the shrine is. All right, so uh, this dog hates me, but uh, I believe we need to go to the uh, the bath area, the, the the water area, the watering hole, whatever it's called. We need to get a uh, the laundry pool. There we go. We need to get some uh, some rupees. Hopefully, we have enough rupees to get a map from Tingle. I do know that much. Boop 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 boop. Ah, uh, we didn't get him. Bitch, get your ass over here. Oh, you got caught. <laughs> Please help me. Please hear my plea. The Max Skull Kid has broken me apart and scattered my pieces. Please find a way to return me to the fairy found in North Clocktown. boop a doop -ba doop Yeah, so once we get a map, because I always get lost in Clocktown. So, uh, a map would be super duper 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 helpful. I believe he can go this way. No, we can't. That guy doesn't like brown tree people. Leave me alone, dog. Shit. Shit! Alright, not bad. I think this should be getting close to where we need to be. Southern Clock Town. Should be... Oh, we're in West Clock Town. I think we need to go to North Clock Town, South Clock Town, up, down, left, right, Clock Town. 
Right, that's where we came from. Oh no. Maybe it's over here. Don't believe so. Should be close by though. Let's see, let's see, let's see. That put us right back to where the fuck we were. Type of bullshit. What type of that sum of my bullshit is this? Uh, I think it should be right up here, to be honest. Just trying some shit out. Just thinking about it. Yes, this is exactly where we want to be. And there's Tingle. Another unique character that should have a different voice. I don't think this Tingle voice is going to be ass. <laughs> What's this? Green Crush, White Fairy? Sir, could you by chance be a force fairy? Oh my, my name is Tingle, I think I am the same as you, sir. A force fairy. Alas, though I am already age 35, no fairy has come to meet me yet. My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I tell you, Tingle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I, I know, I know. We should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange, I will sell you a map for cheap as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Ah, uh, yes, buy the Clock Town map. I don't even know how many rubies we have. Motherfucker, we got a map! The red arrow on the map shows where you entered, and the yellow arrows show your current location. Oh, oh Tingle never forget, good sir. Do you know how to use my maps? Tap the map on the lower screen to zoom in and out. Tap the map button to view the map screen. There's a lot to see there, so be sure to check it out. Welcome again. Tingle, Tingle, Kululimpa. There are the magic words that Tingle created himself. Don't steal them. Don't worry about it, dog. I won't steal them. I promise I won't even try. I won't even try to steal them. Didn't even cross my mind. All right, motherfucking great fairy. Oh no, the great fairy. Oh no. Reunited and it feels so good. <laughs> Creepy ass great fairy. <laughs> Tattle and you, young one of the altered sheep. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. I am the great fairy of magic. I thought that mass child was helping me and I grew careless. All I can offer you now is, is this. I shall grant you magic power as a sign of my gratitude. Please accept it. Ew, 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 boy, mm. Yeah! <laughs> that's like some shit a wrestler would do. Mm, yeah! <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's like one of the taunts you can set in like WWE 2K15 or something. Got some magic power, baby. The man who lives in the observatory outside of town may know of the Skull Kid's whereabouts. That wasn't a voice. But be careful. You must not underestimate the child's powers, kind young one. If ever you return to your former shape, come see me. I shall give you more help. Why don't you just change me back to my fucking former self? You and your magical powers, you, you fucking manly ass great fairy. Do, 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 do. All right, not bad. All right, so this episode's already gone on for a very, very, ouch, a very, very long time. Fuck you, fucking ass. I just go this way. Whatever. Fuck you. We got a map. I can dig it. This should be South Clock Town. Oh yeah, it makes sense. All right, so this game you can't save everywhere, so we have to save with these owls. I remembered in one of the failed recordings. <laughs> so we're gonna save our progress here. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, my 3DS battery is dying, so what a perfect time to stop. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I have to record again tomorrow. 
Or maybe I get in one more episode before we end up ending it. But I'm kind of concerned about this battery. Probably get saved though. Dope. Dope Rooney. But uh, yeah, thanks, for, thanks you guys for, for watching. If you guys did enjoy today's episode, feel free to uh, give it a little support and smack the fuck up out of that like button. Show it some love. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it. I'm really excited to you know play through it and finally beat this game. It's gonna be a grand adventure. But yeah, after um, we will be finishing up the uh, the current projects on the channel. It should be going up on the 13th. It should be a Tuesday. So yeah. So um, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.